I am so excited for you to be able to, you know, serve in the Eugene mission. It's going to be the greatest months of your life. I can promise that. Uh, the great thing about serving here locally in in the United States is how blessed you are to be able to go back and visit your mission. Just months after I got back from my mission, I was able to go back and reconnect with those people. And there's so many friendships that are eternal that you can make on your mission. And so I uh, just to encourage you to take advantage of every one of those opportunities to be a friend to everyone and uh, create those, those relationships that are going to last forever. You're going to learn so much as you are humble and enter the mission field uh, ready to learn. You're going to have some amazing experiences and just let the Lord know that you are there on His errand and that if there's any any uh, thing that He wants you to do, that you're, you're ready to, to run that for Him, just as, as Thomas S. Monson is a great example of that. And uh, it's, it's going to be uh, the, the best hard thing that, that you ever do uh, for you and for so many people that you're going to be able to touch. And I, the Lord really knows you and uh, that he, he has called you to this, to this mission. Uh, and that's something that was confirmed to me as I was called to the Oregon Eugene mission. And uh, it's beautiful. Just soak it in as, as, you, as you have the time to do so. And uh, I, I know that the Savior really loves every single one of those people, no matter who you meet. And try to love them as the Savior would love them. And uh, share the gospel with, uh, uh, with all, of, all of your heart. Uh, be on fire for the gospel every day. And I know that you'll see the blessings in the future. And just live one day at a time and, and really make it count. And... Uh, I know that's that's true, that that's going to bring so many blessings to you and to those around you. And I share that in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.